Wow. Hey. Nice Howdy. to see you again. Always great to see you. You know, I, as I said in the intro, you, you used to work for this little outfit called The Daily Show. But, you know, The Office is... You, do you probably work at The Office as long as The Daily Show or longer? Longer. Wow. Wow. Yeah. I, I like what it a fantastic more. thing to be been, 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 been part of, you know? Yeah. That's, no, that that was, is a show uh... you can watch again after the first time you watch it. Whereas topical humor, basically, you watch it once and you're done. That's true. You're this, right. is, this is just the kindling of entertainment. No one's binge watching the glory days of The Daily Show when, when we were on it, right? Um, I am. <laughs> All right. I am. No, but people are binge watching The Office. People are it's people crazy. watching it over and over again, and a whole new generation's discovering it now. Yeah, it's kind of ridiculous. L like young kids who weren't even alive when it started come up to me in airports and they're like, Rid it did do. <laughs> and I'm like, right on. That's it was awesome. It's my honor to be Broccoli Rob. Thank you so That's much. That's right, for yes. Me. I was Broccoli Rob. I, I was your nemesis. Yes. Thank you so much. That it was, was uh, it was people... an honor to have you. Yeah, I get compliments on that, and I never even <laughs> got to be in the same room with you when we did it, because it was all done via remote. Oh, that's right. But you yeah. know, you've achieved a lot in your career, and I'm extremely proud of you. But I think it's fair to say. <laughs> right. <laughs> I'm not sure this is going to end well. <laughs> <laughs> but Broccoli Rob is your crowning achievement. Of course. I mean, right? It's, it's of the course. best. Of course. Because, again, you can watch it twice. You can't <laughs> yes. watch this twice. Now, uh, okay, let, let, I want to talk about one thing about your career, though, is that you're, you're from the South, and I'm from the South, and Southern, Southern men are expected to be gentlemen, and uh, uh, you, you're a young man from Georgia. You're expected to be polite yeah. from the South. To a fault, almost. Sure. Okay. And um, that's how we lost the Civil War. Just too polite about it. <laughs> go, go ahead. You guys, yeah, you, go, go ahead. Burn Atlanta. Right. That's right. fine. You go. You go. But you, you've been in some things that require not politeness. I mean, the Hangover movies are not polite movies. No. Being a correspondent for The Daily Show, you had to ask terrible things. Downright and, rude. <laughs> downright rude. Yeah. How do you... How Confrontational. Do you, how do you get... How do you reconcile th that... That that career and and the politeness yeah. required from your youth. That's a great question. Thank as you. a as a, I mean, we're both genteel, right? S sophisticated Southerners, which I think is another way of saying we're both like super repressed. Yes. And <laughs> and not uh, good at sports. And, and, <laughs> uh, and so and and maybe even bullied a little as kids. So I all of that repression, I think, is just needed an outlet. Which is how the hangover came about. Oh, so <laughs> so basically your career is just an expression of repressed rage. Yes, that's exactly okay. right. Yes. Well, ditto, my uh, friend. Although there 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 are there are some some good things that that uh, that came of it too. Uh, the the do to do that Andy says on the yes. office. That started actually. A lot of people ask me where that came from. It started as a um, a thing that these these bullies at my school would, like, after they gave you a wedgie or pushed you down or, or, or you know, humiliated you somehow, they'd go, ru -da 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 -da! <laughs> as a sort of, like, expression of dominance. Like, I just owned you. Wait, wait a second. Their expression of dominance was ru -da 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 -da. Yeah. No, it, it, did, it didn't make any sense. And, and it was like, and that's what made it even more terrifying. It's like, <laughs> it's just one of those irrational expressions. Uh, so I, I took that and I, and I made something positive. It became a uh, oh, it became an Andy Bernard's expression of joy. Sure. Well, uh, now you got the new movie Tag. Okay, this is based on a true story. I understand. Uh, it is. Yeah, it's very cool actually. These uh, these guys in Spokane, Washington, they really do this. Uh, they Spokane. <laughs> Somebody. All right. They uh, th this group of ten guys. Um, they've been playing the same game of tag for, like, 40 years. And, and still doing it. They still do it. So it started when they were in grade school, and, uh, and then now, as adults, one month out of the year, they, it's open season. And they just go berserk, and they travel around the country, they hunt each other down, like, you know, like, hunting an animal for sports. And until, and until they're back together again, one guy is it. Yeah. One guy's it for the whole year. And then that, that month, it's just tag is on. And it's insane, Do they right? get hurt or do they... Because um, that sounds like adult men chasing each other around. 
trying to tag each other, it sounds like at least tearing an ACL has got to happen yeah. at some point. Yeah, I think, uh, I th yeah. I mean, certainly reenacting it, we, we, we hurt ourselves. I have to say, the, uh, the, the fact that it's real is the only reason I think you can make that movie, because the, the premise is so absurd. I mean, if you, if, if, you, if you showed me a script about adults who play tag, I would be like, get out of my office. You're a crazy person. Mm -hmm. And then, but the fact that it's real, it's like, oh, my God, that's, that's kind of a cool adventure. I, I want to be a part of that. What if the guy who's it um, dies? Boy, uh, let's <laughs> let, let, let's I'm go down scared. this let's go down this road. This is do it. This is going to be great. Because I'm, um, ser I'm serious. There's a one guy. Uh, let's say the guy's name's Bob. Bob's it during the like the 11 months where they're not tagging each other. He's like tag you're it, Bob. And then during that period of time, <laughs> he falls. He has a bungee jumping accident. Okay. And Bob's gone. What yeah. happens now? Is the game well, over? Well, then no. I think somebody probably at the wake or something just like touches him and then. <laughs> I'm not saying I mean, it's probably be so inappropriate. It resides, it's not in yeah. his consciousness. Yeah. It's in his corpus. Right. It's actually in it's, the body it's itself. In the body. I didn't realize what the rules yeah. were. By the way, I'm guessing. I don't know. I mean, that didn't happen. There were injuries, though, when we were making the movie. I hear Jeremy Renner broke both his arms. Yeah, Jeremy Renner broke both arms. How did he break both of his arms? Um, well, here's what's crazy. So, Jeremy Renner, action star, Hawkeye, he's an Avenger. Sure. He was Jason Bourne. He's Mission Impossible. Is he in this photo? Yeah, he's in this photo right there. Yeah. What is happening? What is happening here? What's oh, this, this is. Uh, oh, that's where we crashed a wedding. That's the. That's sort of. That's the cast of Tag, and we were doing uh, 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 some press in Miami last week, and um, we barged in on a wedding. <laughs> Did they know who you guys were? Well, they, so it, 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 we were we were kind of at, at having dinner next to this wedding, and we were t talking like, should we? Would it be cool or funny to kind of to just jump in and say hi? And we were really back and forth. I don't know. And Jeremy Renner, God bless him, was like, I'll do it. And he just <laughs> walks right in there, and and right away somebody's like, it's Hawkeye. <laughs> and that's when. Uh, we felt like, okay, this is going to be fine. And we all went in there. And That's it was... why he wasn't in Infinity War, because he's at her wedding. Yeah, he's crashing weddings. So how did he break his arms? He fell. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Ed Helms, everybody, thank you so much for being here. Tag is in theaters this Friday. We'll be right back with Michael K. Williams.